I caught wind that those cute little anthropology dupe glasses have been floating around at Hobby Lobby. So I went straight away to see if I could find them. So I have a little Hobby Lobby haul and a home goods haul as well. Um, I went shopping with my mom and we went to Five Below, which I already posted that haul. If you wanna watch it again, I'll link it down below or if you haven't seen it, just link down below. Um, scored some big, great finds. A lot of good things that I got for a boo basket. So I'm like really preparing for that. And um, yeah, so then we went to Home Goods and I wanted to also look into some boo basket things. So I'll show you guys what I got from Micah and Loki. Let's get into it. Let's start off with Hobby Lobby first. Okay, let's start off with the actual glasses themselves. So I know that they have these glasses in a Christmas tree, a Santa, a wreath, a gingerbread, and candy canes. I want the candy cane ones so bad. Like you would think I would want gingerbread, which I do. I want those really bad too, but I only found the Christmas trees at my Hobby Lobby. So here they are. I don't know why they're calling them dupes. Like this is the exact same thing. I, I, I don't know what, what makes this a dupe per se, um, but it was $14.99, but Christmas is 50% off. So like essentially what, $7.50 for them. So I did get two of these just in case I couldn't find the other ones. If I do find the other ones, I'm keeping my receipt and I'm gonna return one of these. I am trying to be more purposeful, especially that I'm in my organization era and I really just, you know. So I got two just in case I didn't find any other ones and I thought two is a really good number. I can have a glass, Micah can have a glass, but if I do find the other ones, I would like to do four of the set. I would like a Christmas tree, a candy cane, a gingerbread man, and I think the Santa. I don't think I really care for the wreath, um, but we'll see what I end up getting. So if I can get those, I will return the second one that's wrapped up in here. I'm not even gonna unwrap it, but there you go. So there's that. Then of course, I'm steadily collecting my little ornaments. So for my glass Christmas tree, which is gonna be in my um, dining room this year. I'm very excited for that, um, but I found this little Coca-Cola. Now this was in another section, it's not glass, it's plastic, but it kind of looks like that material, so I was like, this will pass. But I love Cokes. Like, are you a Dr. Pepper girl? I'm not, I'm a Coke girl. Um, Dr. Peppers have always given me a headache, unfortunately. I wish I could enjoy them, but I don't. But Cokes, love them. And I love the Coke brand in general. It's just such a vintage classic. And have you guys ever dove into the, um, what's it called? Mandela effect of Coca-Cola? It'll blow you away. Just type in Mandela effect on YouTube, Coca-Cola, you'll see what I'm talking about. Um, then I got this one. Now this one is glass or it's that super fragile material. Um, it's by Robert Stanley and it is a Neapolitan ice cream sandwich and Neapolitan is my favorite ice cream. So I got it because it has that meaning for me. I'm probably, not probably, I do have some ornaments that are just like random, you know? And they just won't have like a backstory, but I am trying to get ornaments that I feel like do on this tree in particular, like the glass ornaments, I do want them to have some type of like connection to me, Micah and Loki. Um, so there's that. So with that said, I got the little skateboard. Skateboards remind me of Micah. There was a time where I really thought when she was younger, like in her teen, like preteen, 11, 12, 13, I thought that she could have like, if I would have put her, in skateboarding, I think she would have made it to X Games and I think she could have been a skateboarding star. She's always been balanced and she's always just ridden a skateboard so well. But then we moved to Florida and she got on one and if you guys remember that video, <laughs> comment and let me know if you remember that video. But I caught it on camera. It was when Megan came in 
and we were in a Target and she got on the skateboard and she just busted. She sprawled all over the ground. So anyways, I got this little skateboard. Um, and then, let's see. I've actually had this bag for a while. I forgot to include it in the last Hobby Lobby video. So I've already forgotten. Oh, you guys know this is Micah. She is a gamer. I love that she's a gamer. I think it's so cute and charming. I played games growing up. I still play games. You guys already know. So that one, also a no-brainer. Then let's see what's in this one. I literally don't remember. It just gave Dollar Tree. And I had to. The pill, and I I use these. I use these for when I travel and I put my little you know, magnesium and all my little lysine and daily supplements. That was just so cute. It was $8.99, but 50% off of that. The skateboard was $7.99, 50% off of that. And I have one more, and then we'll move into Hobby Lobby, or Home Goods. I've forgotten, what is this? <gasps> the little lemon. It's just so cute. It's like, I love lemons. I love lemons and strawberries. Like when it comes to deciding a fruit in terms of like decor and the look of it, strawberries and lemons get me every time. So this one was $7.99, but 50% off. And that's it. That's what I picked up from Hobby Lobby. Hopefully next time that you see me, I will have found the other glass. But that's not the end of these charming little glasses. I found some more at Home Goods, and I was like, yep, I'm full on into this collection now, and I found the little ice cream cones. I'm gonna call this the birthday ice cream cones. Maybe it'll be like, you know, and it's also very summery, so I'll pull these out in the summer and for birthdays, and I think it's just super cute. And this was $12.99 for the set. I have lemons, cherries, mushrooms, bats, these, and now these. So, see if we can keep that growing. Then I got these candles, these tapered candles for Micah's Boo Basket. It's $5.99. Orange was perfect for, you know, the whole thing. And then I found these with the fall leaves. What? They're just, they're kind of all over. And I don't know if you can tell, but it's like an extra little wax layer. It's so freaking pretty. This was $5.99. Yeah, these were both $5.99. That's crazy. I don't think this would be a little more, but I'm not complaining. So Michael loves her some tapered candles. So I got those for her boo basket. And speaking of boo baskets, so I got one from Dollar Tree that I thought was gonna be her boo basket. And then I opened it up and I'm actually collecting all of our boo basket stuff in that basket. If you watch my hauls, you know which one I'm talking about. It's black, it's got grid lines on it. It's from the Dollar Tree like laundry section. I've changed my mind. Unfortunately, I did see a much cuter basket at Home Goods and it, I, I, I had to. Um, because then when I also saw one for Loki, I wanted it to match, but here's the one I got for Micah. I just really liked how neutral it was and I'm gonna use it year after year. So I'm not, hopefully I'll remember and I'll keep these on hand properly, but $14.99 for this. And they have this in like a pink background or with like pink ghosts or something. They have so many cute baskets at Home Goods right now. It was when I saw this one that I was like, I wanted their baskets to match. So that's why I ended up deciding to scrap the Dollar Tree one. So, so super cute. So this is Loki's and I had to get the candy corn. And I love that both the baskets were this like beigey sand color. Um, and then I picked up this Harvest Bounty loaf pan. Look how gorgeous. So apparently your bread will end up looking like this. I'm gonna be making banana and chocolate chip bread. I wanna be doing a lot of baking this fall. 
and I was like, let me buy this, $16.99. Seems really durable, really thick. $16.99, mm, I was hoping for like $8.50, but you know, we'll take it. I got this Scrub Daddy. Now this is actually a little puppy, which is really cute, but it's orange. I know they're making an orange pumpkin Scrub Daddy, but I couldn't find it. But I got this for a boo basket. So this was $3.99. So there's that. And then I got this popcorn, this caramel with sea salt popcorn. Um, you know how that food gets you at TJ Maxx and Home Goods. $4.99. I have no idea how long it's been sitting there. That's the mystery of it all. How long has this been sitting there? I know there's an expiration date, but that's besides the point. How long has it been there in that store? Um, but I did get this for my boo basket. So there's that. Then I picked up these socks, Hallmark socks for Micah. Um, I love the little slice of pumpkin pie. These are just plain and then the stripes. And then I guess these are plain as well. They were $7.99 and I thought they would be really fun for her and her little basket. She's, she's at that age now where she's loving the seasons. Like when she was younger, she obviously experienced it from how I decorated, but she didn't really like care for it that much. Um, she was just never that kid, but now she's getting into it. She has like the sheets and the blankets. She has little decors and trinkets out. So it's starting to interest her. So I feel like all of these little touches, she's gonna really love. Um, and then the rest of it is what's going in Loki's boo basket. So I got him this orange Frisbee, $5.99. The toys at Home Goods and TJ Maxx cannot be beat. They're just more expensive usually anywhere else. Then I got him this $4.99 because hello, it matches like literally the same person. If his little mouth would have been black like that, it would have, and they didn't have this buckle, it would have been the exact same thing. So I thought I had to get it. Um, and then because it's an alien and it just gives Halloween, I thought it was really cute. I like the crinkle, his little arms. Um, this was also $5.99. And the last toy, I was like, you know what, let me try some new toys for him. I, he always gets these, but I need to experiment with toys. And this one was $7.99. It is a heavy duty. I got it in black. They actually have this in orange, but I got this one in black just to like change up the colors. This is a tire biter. And it's also like retrieving. Um, there's a hole in here. I'm wondering if you can like put toys. I don't really know, but, or treats. But I do know that Loki needs more stimulating toys and I'm like working on that. So that is actually my haul. Um, I feel like I went through that kind of quickly, but I was just so excited for these and to share them and let you guys know that they're at Hobby Lobby and I almost didn't find them. I walked out the store several times, um, but now I'm officially on the hunt for the other ones. So stay tuned. We'll see if I can find it. That's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed my quick fall haul and I'll see you next time. Bye.